I'm going to show you how to add a page to the namespace we've created for you. In this case, our namespace or wiki space is Learning Commons, as you see here. And here are some associated pages that people have already created. So we have one for the Chapman Learning Commons, one for content, and I'm going to create one for the Writing Center. So the way I do that is to go up to my browser bar here. The important thing about a namespace when you're creating a new page is to add a colon after our namespace, which is Learning Commons, and then Writing Center. You can just leave a space. You don't need to do anything about that. It'll create the page for you. And then I'm going to click Enter. And it's going to give me some options. And I'm going to click on Edit this page. Add some content here. And I'm going to save this page. Now, what's interesting is I should be able to go back to the root page, which is the Learning Commons page, and I'll see my newly created page here. Now, what I'll want to do eventually um, is add some just some basic information here about um, what kind of pages I'm going to sub pages I'm going to be collecting under the Writing Center, and one of those important pages might be the description. So first of all, because this page is going to be my landing page, I want to add some code for a dynamic page list. So every time I create a sub page after the Writing Center, it'll automatically list my pages created here. So I'm going to click on the Edit button. I am going to find my code, which is here, for dynamic page list. I'm going to cut that, paste it. Now you'll see that um, this is the wrong name for my page. It's not called content, and the reason for that is I just cut and pasted it from another page. So I'm going to add in the name of my page now, which is Writing Center. I want to make sure it's exactly the same spelling, which it is, and I'm going to save that page. And you'll see it gives me an error warning that there are no results, and that's simply because I haven't created any subpages yet. So I'm going to do that now and I'm going to pay, create a page called Description. And I do this this time. I've already got my root page. So Writing Center is my root page. It comes after the colon. So this time I'm just adding a slash up here, as you could see, and the name of my new page. So once again, I'm going to edit the page. This is that's an important step, um, so that you don't lose your page. And I'll add some content here. Save it, and it gives me a little breadcrumb back to my uh, index page for the Writing Center. So I can click on that, and I can see that under Associated Pages, I have. Um, Writing Center description, which I can add to at some future time.